to the history department. Here at Easington, we believe that history is the best subject because of facts like this. One of the first things you study is the Norman Conquest. Did you know that William Duke of Normandy, or William the Conqueror, burst at his own funeral? In 1006, the Scots lost a battle at Durham, and their severed heads were placed on spikes around the town. During the 10 hundreds, we were invaded by the Vikings. Some Vikings believed that the first men and women came from the sweat of a giant's armpit. Bruce. You may think that the first person to land in America was Columbus. Eh, eh. The first person to discover America was a Viking, Leif Erikson. The kings of England had some very funny habits. King Henry III was given a polar bear by the King of Norway. He kept it in the Tower of London and it swam in the Thames. The plague was a major problem for the people of medieval England. It was believed that if you took a live chicken's bottom and strapped it to your armpit, then it would cure you of the plague. Don't try this at home. Henry VIII is not known for being a good husband. An example of this is he was playing tennis when Anne Boleyn was executed. In Tudor and Stuart times, a sign of being rich was having rotten teeth. This was because sugar was really, really, really expensive. In Tudor and Stuart times, a cook tried to poison the soup. His punishment was to be boiled to death in a giant cauldron. The people of Elizabethan England were not very clean. The Queen herself had four baths a year, whether she needed to or not. You will know that Henry VIII was married six times. He actually married his fourth wife, Anne of Cleves, without even meeting her. Another Tudor Stuart fact. Lady Jane Grey was Queen for nine days. She then lost her head. One of the punishments in Tudor and Stuart times was to be hung, drawn and quartered. You were hanged until you were almost dead, your organs were removed and finally you were cut into four pieces. Ouch. King Charles I is the only king we have ever executed. He was so worried about people thinking he was shivering from fear that he wore two shirts to his execution. In the 1800s, sausages were known as bags of mystery. Do you know what's in your sausage? Abraham Lincoln is famous for being one of only two American presidents to be assassinated. He was also a professional wrestler. Lots of different weapons were used in World War I. Poison gas was first used in April 1915. Make sure you've got your mask on. In the trenches, the rats were the size of cats. In World War I, soldiers' boots were made of really hard leather. To make them softer and stop them getting blisters, they had to wee on them. Imagine doing that on your school shoes. World War I was a very noisy place to be. One explosion in France was so loud that they heard it in London. The youngest British soldier to be killed in World War I was only 12 years old. In World War II, soldiers were only given three pieces of toilet paper a day. Is that enough? One of the topics we cover at GCSE History is crime and punishment. In the 17th century, if you had a birthmark or a mole, you were thought to be a witch. Burn her! Remember, the more you know about the past, the better prepared you are for the future.